everyone, today I'm going to do an empties video. I've been seeing tons of people putting these videos up. I really like it because not only are you getting to see the products that I'm using up, but you're getting kind of a mini review on each product. I'm just randomly going to grab these products out. I don't have that many, but I figured it was enough to film, so I will just go ahead and jump right in. The first thing that I have used up is my Rimmel London Glam Eyes Mascara. And this mascara, basically, it didn't dry up on me. It just literally is pretty empty. I will just show you the wand. It's really, really a tiny wand. Absolutely love this mascara for your bottom lashes. It is absolutely perfect. Also, if you're wearing false lashes, it works really good at kind of bonding the natural lash with the false lash to make it look very seamless. And so I will most certainly be repurchasing this mascara. I think it runs around around six dollars at the drugstore so I would highly recommend it and mine is in extreme black. The next product that I finished is the Bath & Body Works Shea and Rich Shower Gel in the scent Honey Sweetheart and it looks like this. I am in love with this scent and I think that this is going to be on sale at the semi-annual sale that is coming up starting on June 12th and so I'm super excited. I think that these retail for around $11. I absolutely love these shower gel. It, they are shea infused so they are ultra soft on your skin and they smell absolutely wonderful. This one says Honeyed violets sprinkled with pink sugar put you in the sweetest mood. So I will be repurchasing that scent. The next thing that I have is the Del Delin Plus Body Butter in Mango. Uh, and this is completely empty. I'm not sure where I got this, but I will put the link in the bottom bar. It is very, very rich and um, the mango scent smells delicious. I do have other scents of these that I have to go through before I will be repurchasing, but I do highly recommend this brand and I will link it in the bottom bar. The next thing is another product from Bath & Body Works and this is their Raspberry Pink Peony Antibacterial Deep Cleansing Hand Soap. And honestly, I bought this without smelling it. I bought it because of the packaging because I thought it was so pretty. And um, I will repurchase this if it comes back during the semi-annual sale. I think I purchased it last year during the semi-annual sale for like $3. And it smells awesome. It smells like raspberries mixed with kind of a florally, almost a peach smell. Um, this is the one that has the little beads in it. And uh, I personally prefer the foaming soap. And I will definitely be repurchasing this scent but probably in the foaming one. The next thing is also from Bath & Body Works. Jeez, you can either tell that I love Bath & Body Works or that I was really wanting to smell good. So the next thing is this Malibu Heat Body Lotion. This was one of the mini sizes. Absolutely love this scent. It's perfect for summer. It seriously smells like you're putting... Um, I don't know, almost like a sunscreen or a tanning lotion mixed with this coconut and yumminess. It smells so good. It smells like you're going out and to be in the warm summer and I wish they would come out with this in a candle because I would buy it in a heartbeat. The next thing that I finished is my Kenra Perfect Medium Hairspray. This again is travel size. I like to keep these types of things in my purse for easy um, usage. So if I'm on the go, I can pull this out, spray it on my hair. So this is the perfect spray. It doesn't leave your hair crunchy. Did I say it's in the hole 13, which is the medium hole spray for Kenra? And there's only two more products. And speaking of hair products, the next one is this Numi Hydrating Conditioner Hydro Punch. And honestly, this stuff is absolutely amazing. I love the way it smells. It has kind of a musky scent, but it is so soothing and nice. I was a huge fan of this conditioner. It smells really good. And um, it is Seratin K Sage Extract, Bamboo Extract, Argan Oil, and no parabens or paraffins. This is just a sample size that I got in some sort of a sample box. 
I will definitely be repurchasing this. This is good for color treated hair or any hair really that has been heat styled that needs an extra bit of hydration. Highly recommend this product and so yeah, I will definitely be repurchasing. The next thing is this Juice Beauty Green Apple Moisturizer. And this is an SPF of 15, perfect for summertime. I'm really sad that I ran out of this because, uh, yeah, it's perfect to use every day on a daily basis. I am using a different um, moisturizing lotion, facial lotion right now, so I won't be repurchasing this right away, but this is definitely something that I could see myself repurchasing in the future. It smells absolutely amazing. I have a Bath & Body Works um, scent also that's in the scent Beautiful Days, and when I put this on with that, it just, they mesh really, really well, and they s both smell like green apples, so loved that. Enjoyed it while I had it. it so, um, yeah, this again is Juice Beauty, the Organic Solution Green Apple SPF 15 Moisturizer. So that is everything that I had to show you that I've used up. If you've got an empties video that you've filmed, then leave that in the comments down below as a video response. So if you guys enjoyed this video, give this video a thumbs up and make sure you hit the subscribe button. I appreciate all of you and so I will talk to you all very soon in my next video. Bye. absorbing it into your hair. You can just feel your hair turning into this soft... <coughs> it smells like hot. <laughs>